Red Bull reflects on glaring flaw and takes a swipe at Mercedes. We need desperately the engine to concertina in performance, said Horner after watching Mercedes romp to victory in the season-ending Abu Dhabi GP. Mercedes were in a class of their own. Hats off, they are doing a great job but engine performance is a key differentiator. Despite three victories in 2017, Red Bull was soundly beaten by Mercedes and ended the season nearly 150 points behind second-placed Ferrari. If you look at the number of points we have given away through unreliability, it's close to 160, Horner told Sky F1 in Abu Dhabi. Engine reliability has hit us really hard. At the beginning of the year we undelivered on the chassis, we didn't hit the ground running. We understood those problems quickly and moved to address them quickly. We will take all the lessons from this year into next year and we have a lot to be optimistic about. We are hopeful that the engine situation will improve and we are getting a lot of promises that will be the case. But what's been really encouraging is the last 25% of the season, is, we have had one of, if not the, strongest cars. If we can take that on RB14, we can give Merck and Ferrari a closer fight. The RB13 hasn't always been up to scratch. Speaking after Sunday's race, Horner added, we have DN fed in far too many races. The RB13 has DN fed in 13 races and has had 13 podiums. Red Bull has strongly opposed F1's engine reduction for next season when the cars will be restricted to just three power units apiece without penalty, down from the current four-engine limit. Mercedes has defended the reduction, whacking Red Bull for its hypocritical opposition, while Ferrari is believed to have voted down a proposal from Red Bull to maintain the current figure of four. Going to three engines for 21 races is nuts. Contrary to whatever Toto, Wolf, Mercedes chief, says, his non-executive chairman, F1 legend Nicky Lauda, was arguing for four engines earlier in the year because it is a false economy. I would hate to see the championship decided on grid penalties. Horner also added that Adrian Newey, the team's legendary technical chief, would be as involved in the design of the RB14 as he was in the RB13.